problem. So if it helps, we can substitute in x squared plus one with u. So we have u squared minus four x squared. And the reason we can do that, kind of abstract it away, make it easier to see. So difference of perfect squares, we have u minus two x and u plus two x. Now we can substitute back in for u and we get x squared plus one minus two x. And then, u, oops, x squared plus one plus two x. So we end up with um, plus two x. So x squared minus two x plus one, and then x squared plus two x plus one. And this can be broken down into x minus one squared, and this can be broken down to x plus one squared. Pretty cool, and that's it. Okay, I hope this helped you out. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.